Hello and welcome to lesson three uh, in the online business course and we're going to be talking today about development of an idea in order to have a business an online business an information online business you want to sell information um, we're going to be talking today about information online business we're not going to be talking about products selling products that's so going to be for next time so it's going to be here information products so in this information product it means you're going to sell information you're going to you're going to educate people about a topic you're going to search a topic research a topic gather as much information as you can about the topic and then you're going to deliver it to people in a in a nice format that will be pleasing to them, that will make it easy for them to learn, uh, that will not give them pain when they are learning it. So that's what you want to do. Look, so the first thing you're going to do, how to find your idea, you're going to look at what excites you and grabs your interest. What is it that excites you? What is it that you like? What is it that you want to learn about? You can learn about it and be excited about it and then teach it to people. What is this thing that you want to learn about? Uh, is it uh, carpentry? Is it making an offline business, like starting a restaurant? Is it um, cooking? Is it uh, engineering? Is it uh, software development? Is it uh, finding your way around London? Is it uh, looking at the um, museums of London? Is it so million and million and million types of ideas that you could have? Once you locate or once you um, you you zoom in on the idea, once you, you you choose your idea, what you need to do, you need to read everything about it, everything that you can read about the topic as possible. Take six weeks to eight weeks, just read and read and read and watch videos and read and watch videos, discuss with people, have uh, conversations with people, make be obsessed about it, you know, be manic about it, about the idea. Keep reading, reading, reading until you become an expert. And the best way is for someone who doesn't know the idea and then learns it in six weeks or eight weeks, he can deliver it to people much better than someone who knows the topic for 20 years because the, the information is fresh in your head. And you just learned it and you can give it to people in a, in a, in a very clear way. Okay. So. So that's what you do. Then once you finish, once you finish um, learning about these things after six weeks or eight weeks, and your head is full about it, start writing about it. Write a plan of your book. You know, writing a book is not difficult. Although people they think it's difficult, it's very very simple to write a book. You just need a little plan. What you're going to be talking about the introduction. And you need to divide it into chapters. Let's say you divide it into 10 chapters or maybe four chapters or three chapters, whatever you like. And then in this chapter, each chapter is subdivided into sections. Section sub, like chapter one, section 1.1, section 1.2, section 1.3, and that's it. And then chapter two, section 2.1, 2.3. And then you each, each chapter has got a little introduction or you introduce the chapter and you talk about what you want to talk about um, about it. And then you make it. And there's plenty of information on how to write books on the Internet. I'm not going to go into that. And don't write a book that is very big or anything like that. 24 pages is very good. Why I'm saying 24? Because 24 pages is uh, the minimum to, to, have, um, um, to have a hard uh, cover book on Amazon. 24 pages. That's all you need, about 24, 30 pages, which is you can write in about a week. Even less than that, if you're if you're a fast writer, uh, that's it. Now you have a product. Congratulations! Once you write this, now you learned about the topic for six weeks, eight weeks. Now you wrote a book and you have a book. Your book, write it in Google Drive. 
it's about much better to write it in Google Drive because it gives you the facility to um, to convert it to any format you like and the format that is used in Amazon is available in Google Drive okay so write it in Google Drive um, that's all of, that's the first product the first product is your book second I'm, I'm referring to this business model that I've created here where I have a book here I have a book and then I have videos you know, and these videos you can enter so the book you click on it and you go to Amazon and then you can buy my book in Amazon so that's the website where I advertise my book and here you can subscribe and then I give you a password and you enter the private area and there you can get to this website where I have a hundred videos 60 videos English 40 Arabic and um, yeah so I'm referring to that so now I'll give you the uh, the first half is writing a book the second half is writing is, is doing the videos making videos about the topic that you've chosen your videos could be videos just talking head like in my videos is just talking head let me show you the videos that I have words words have an effect on our minds words program our emotional system so you could have something like that you could have just a talking head or if it's your interest is like uh, going around London you can take videos of London and put them and you can talk about the videos and you can give information about let's say the museums of London uh, you can go inside the museums record and record the way to the museum and information about it for example so every day in the morning storm your brain to find topics video topics like if you want to have let's say 30 or 40 videos you need to have uh, ideas for the topics of the videos so do a brainstorming and find the videos that you want to add you, you want to talk about write down a plan of work and the subtopics will be the videos so that you can include the videos record your videos on your smartphone you don't need to buy any special equipment just your smartphone is enough and upload to google drive Upload to Google Drive or YouTube and make video your videos unlisted. I'll tell you why. Make your videos unlisted or private. Make them unlisted so that you can send the link to somebody, but um, they're not public yet. Then you can think in your own time. What do you want to make them public, or do you want to leave them unlisted and just people with the link can have them? So you could do that. And uh, yeah, wrap your videos in a new in a new playlist. Write your videos in a playlist, and voila, you have a product. You have now you have a book, and you have videos. And next time we're gonna talk about what you're gonna do with newly with new your newly created um, uh, content. But don't forget to upload your videos to Google Drive as well. Because sometimes we're gonna maybe we you can use Google Drive or you can use uh, Google um, YouTube in order to place your videos on a website if that's what you want. You can have them on Google and that's the end of the story. You have your videos on Google and you sell your book on Amazon and that's the end of the story. You put a link in your in description of the videos and that's the end of the story. But I'm gonna show you how to do the business model that I showed you here. This one here. This one is very good because it will give you. Um, uh, a brand like this is mind taxis mind taxis mind taxis.com that is my brand so I can sell this website I can sell it it's making money and I can sell it you can sell it for a lot of money so Google that's what they take from you you give them all the glory and you give them all the um, the branding and thus you're promoting the Google YouTube brand here you're promoting yourself you're promoting your own brand that's the difference this is what people don't realize when they go to YouTube but if that's what you want if that's what you want to do to be on YouTube you can be on YouTube so it's getting a little bit to detail 
but I just want to talk about the idea and how to generate the idea and how to generate your content. So in this video, I've showed you how to do the content, how to, how to write a book, how to gather the information. And I've showed you how to think about um, uh, video ideas, you know, brainstorm about the video ideas. Let's say you, for this video series that I'm doing now, I'm brainstorming and I'm writing my ideas um, here. I'm brainstorming, I'm, I'm writing ideas here. Anytime I get an idea, for example, this is my plan, plan of work. Lesson online versus offline, emotional intelligence and business, case study, uh, idea talk about what, uh, what the idea to make the lesson. This is where I am today. And then I have more and more ideas. So anytime I want to add something to my plan, I just um, come back to this, uh, to this uh, document that I've created and I write down again. So this was lesson two about um, how to Yeah, this was lesson two and it was about the development of the idea until next uh, time have a good day